by the tree of life lives a honking flock of pure pinkness. I'm coming to check on our lesser flamingos. These guys are from Africa. Hi guys, good morning. How you doing? Hi everybody. It's egg laying season for the lesser flamingos and the potential parents are busy. But it hasn't always been this way. We've had absolutely no luck breeding these birds. We have had one chick in 20 years. We always have a plan, but in nature, our plan doesn't always fit in with reality. So sometimes that we can have what we feel is a fantastic season, lots of rain, lots of nest building, but no eggs. It's a bad time for no breeding. All species of flamingos are under some type of environmental pressure. Out of all the species, lessers are probably the one that are the most threatened at this time. They're feeling a lot of pressure in the world in regards to habitat loss and habitat destruction. To encourage more romance, the team looks for ways to improve the habitat itself. The team decided they wanted to try something different with the nesting material. It was an email that I received um, from Animal Kingdom, and it was a big surprise. Disney's Animal Kingdom asked if they could borrow some baseball clay for their flamingos. It's a special combination of clay and sand that really works well with this Florida climate. With the rain and the humidity, it's really malleable when it's wet, but it hardens really strongly when it's dry, and the birds just really took to it. Containing more clay than Florida soil, the infield mix passed the flamingo nest test. An egg appeared, and then they were on a roll. I don't know what's in this clay, but we're gonna call it magic clay because we're already at eggs five and six. We're really excited. We thought we had our plan together and the flamingos were on the same page. But only one egg proved fertile. And for the parents of that egg, disaster struck. The father suffered from a leg injury, so we had to take him up to our hospital. Their process is the pair lays the egg and then one incubates while the other one eats and then they switch. But the mom couldn't raise the egg by herself. Flamingos are serially monogamous. So with the biological parents down, the team looks for another solution that can be found in nature. In the wild, it's not uncommon for same-sex pairs to bond. They build these strong relationships that can last for years. We decided that our best option was actually to give the egg to our really great pair of male birds. Same-sex pair Blush and Bashful swoop in to the rescue. These two boys have been together for a long time. They've never shown any interest in any of the females that have come over to Discovery Island. We don't want to give the egg to the other pairs because that would stop them from possibly producing their own. These potential dads quickly make a connection with their new responsibility. So Blush and Bashful got the egg, and the whole time they were talking to the egg, which is very important. It connects them to the chick. So they were making that connection and building that bond. The boys tuck the only fertile egg safely under their caring wings. The future of the flock now rests on them. We're hoping that instinct will kick in and they'll know exactly what to do. 